Vice President Mike Pence made a stop in Macon today, campaigning for Secretary of State Brian Kemp ahead of Tuesday's runoff for the Republican gubernatorial candidate. Ensley Nichols was at the rally and spoke to several people who were excited to see the vice president in their own hometown. We're about an hour away from the vice president coming here to Macon, and the crowds are filling up all around the stage, patiently awaiting his arrival. Hundreds showed up to the Macon Centerplex Saturday yeah, afternoon to see Vice President Mike Pence, and their excitement ran high. Because he's our Vice President of the United States. He's, the, you know, he's there with us. I'll be shocked if I get close enough to even get a good look at him. But. Many surprised Pence made a stop through central Georgia. Well, obviously, uh, when you get the Vice President uh, anywhere, that's a big deal. So we don't get to see a Vice President very often, you know, so um, that was remarkable. You know, the excitement, you know, it's... it's it just makes my heart, you know, <laughs> excited. I don't know how else to say it. People waited in line for hours just to be in the same room as the vice president, who was in town to campaign for Republican gubernatorial candidate and current secretary of state, Brian Kemp. <laughs> Kemp spoke to a roaring crowd inside the centerplex arguing that Kemp is the best candidate to fight crime and illegal immigration while protecting Georgians' Second Amendment rights to own and carry guns. Pence also shared a message to supporters in the crowd. You know, President Trump asked me to be here today for one reason and one reason only, and that is to tell you that President Donald Trump and I fully endorse Brian Kemp for governor of the great state of Georgia. And before the swarm of people left, Pence reminded the people to do one more thing, get out and vote. Grab a family member, your next door neighbor, and bring them out to polls coming this Tuesday. Kemp faces Lieutenant Governor Casey Cagle in Tuesday's runoff. In Macon, Inslee Nichols, 13 WMAZ News. Polls open at 7 and 7 a.m. and close at 7 p.m. on Tuesday. Other statewide offices on the ballot include Lieutenant Governor, Secretary of State, and Agricultural Commissioner.